Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome to today's Bitcoin update for Wednesday 24th of August and uh, we are back with another another video right here so basically let's dive into the daily time frame right over there and let's look at what Bitcoin really is doing you know Bitcoin is just hitting its head again and again right on this level we are not getting across across that level today's Wednesday and uh, we are in the middle of the week and there could be some possibilities of a midweek reversal maybe today maybe on thursday who knows okay so if you were to make a relief if you were to make a small relief a small push to the upside then the emas are the best guesses of uh, you know where you're gonna move up so the ema can actually go up to that 10 uh, which is at $22,033 and basically get rejected again and start to roll over to the downside only if and if if the plan is uh, about to be for a small relief to the upside but I don't know I highly doubt if it's gonna happen at the moment because on the four hour time frame you're really hitting your head right on this level okay so just the same way on the one hour time frame previously you had a first bottom and a second bottom right there uh, you actually have one top and the second top right over here okay now in my opinion this level which is twenty one thousand and uh, four hundred eighty or five twenty one thousand five hundred dollars is acting as a massive massive rejection right now and uh, one can even say that this is a big whooping bear flag in the in the making right so you can uh, uh you know bring uh, do something like this you can say that it's just moving sideways and making a very huge bear flag once again on the four hour time frame and if you do break out of that flag then you're looking for a technical target to go from there to there and this is gonna come down to nearly this price level eighteen thousand uh six hundred and sixty dollars now on the daily it does look like a flag on the four hour time frame also looks like a flag to me now weekend is approaching and weekend is gonna start um in the next uh, three days now you do have wednesday and thursdays now from friday you might start to be looking to fall down right so from friday there's something can happen and uh, it's really really important to understand what bitcoin does in the next coming days because when the monthly is actually gonna start when the monthly time frame is everything the monthly is what i'm really really focused on right now because the monthly just shows uh the willingness of bitcoin to dump to the downside and and i do expect bitcoin in the next coming seven days actually to push way lower maybe perhaps even lower than seventeen thousand five seventy seven so uh in seven days a lot can happen a lot can happen many many things can happen but one thing I'm, i am for certain is that i'm not taking any risks against bitcoin there are coins moving up i understand that but it's really really high risk environment right now to even bet against bitcoin because in seven days heck who knows you can actually pump ten thousand dollars all of a sudden and go to 35k it's something that you can expect from bitcoin but there are certain criteria for that one as well but to me man in seven days it's not hard to go down by 20 percent. it can happen in just two hours that you, you go absolutely 10 20 percent like how many of you have seen bitcoin on a five minutes chart dumping by a thousand dollars right so this in seven days it can do anything right now all this small small time frame that you're looking at really doesn't uh is is just a build up for what's coming up next and well, all i see right now is bitcoin putting in a bear flag on a four hour time frame it's putting in a bear flag on a daily time frame and that's pretty much telling me everything that i need to understand that we are looking bad kiddo and we're about to get a, a, a bigger drop to the downside and don't forget that bitcoin has to somehow come down to that level which is 18 19 thousand dollars because it is a technical target out of a rising wedge so this is your rising wedge previously that you really broke out of from there to there and uh this one from here to here that's your rising wedge you've broken out of the rising wedge you came down you made a stop bear flag came down and you are supposed to come down it's a very simple logic it's a very simple rising wedge tra uh, trading you don't need to 
uh, be bothered of what's happening here because by the end of the day the bigger picture is what was a rising wedge and it has to come down to the technical target of nineteen thousand dollars now once we come down there can it go lower can it can it actually hold support at this level because you have a support down there as well you might just come here and then go back up you're not guaranteed that you're gonna go down but if you're gonna go down we're gonna talk about it in the future updates and that's pretty much it for this uh, update on bitcoin i'm gonna see you in the next one i love you